Now this is all of the A-level equations you need for Edexcel physics. This is an A5 version. You can also print out an A4 version or even enlarge it to this version which is an A3 down here. Now what I wanted to do was just make one simple thing that you could refer to while you're practicing questions doing A-level physics. Over here I have some of the mathematical equations that you should be familiar with. I often tend to forget between the area and the volume of a sphere, um, but a lot of the other ones which are on the data sheet I haven't included. A lot of them you will know already. I also have a lot of the constants down here that you're going to be referring to, and the more questions you do, the more familiar with them you're going to become. You will just remember things like the charge, the elementary charge on an electron. You'll remember things like the gravitational constant, but this is for you to double check the numbers when it comes to doing equations and calculations. For the other parts of it here, I've got um, things ordered by the kind of topic that they come up in. So blue is to do with forces and motion. So you can see here we've got uh, some of our SUVAT equations of motion up here. Anything red is to do with electricity or electromagnetism, perhaps as you go into year 13. Um, anything which is yellow is to do with atomic physics and nuclear physics. So what I've done is I've grouped the equations by topic. And although this isn't as detailed as the thing that you're going to be using in your exam, this thing here, especially because it's on one side, can be really useful as it comes to approaching any questions and calculations you're going to be doing in A-level physics. So um, have a look at this. You can download it for free or you can also buy a copy through my online shop. But this is the Edexcel A-level physics data and formula sheet.